Hello, hello, hi, hello. Welcome, welcome to Monday Morsels in Bare Bones Kitchen. How is everybody? I right, see this is my first one, you guys. I haven't even. This is it. This cheers, cheers, y'all. I'm your culinary coach, Harmony. Welcome into my kitchen. All right. So, I am very excited about tonight because it has probably been like 500 years since I've had this. So first of all, I have a, a little bit of oil in the bottom of my pan, right? A little bit of oil. Okay, maybe it's not quite that thick, but it's there's some oil in there because we're we're almost deep frying this stuff. We're gonna rock out with some fried green tomatoes. Uh, thank you, Tracy and Josh, for giving me some green tomatoes. I still have one left over here, and the rest of them are just doing their thing right now. Just doing their thing. I had one as a snack when I got home from work. I love tomatoes, you guys. I should not, I should not love tomatoes as much as I do. All right, so I have some flour here, and in my flour, I have put some salt and some pepper, of course. I did not have, I ran out of my Weber's, and I forgot that I ran out, so I did not have any more. Um, but I do have some of this Tony's, and I had to look up how to say this last name, because it's, I was not real sure, I was not real sure, but the C's are like S's, so it's, I don't, can't even say it. Shaw, yeah, I'm, I'm not even going to try. Tony's, Tony's Cajun seasoning, you guys. Everybody else calls it Tony's too. I listened to it. I Googled it, listened to it like 500 times, and I still can't remember how to say the damn thing. All right. Anyways, we're rocking that tonight. Hi, Sue. We got some garlic because I just like garlic. Okay. That's, that's, that's all there is to say about that. I just like garlic. All right. So we're going to crack a couple eggs here. Did not leave myself a spot to dump the shells, but that's okay. I'm going to turn this down a little bit because it's been on for a few minutes and I'm just over here flapping my jaws. Over here flapping my jaws. I saw your brother today on my way home. I had to give him some, give him some crap. I was thinking, who is this freaking guy that's just taking his sweet ass time walking across the parking lot? Like, hello, do you not see there's a car behind you? And of course he didn't because he was on his phone. And then we joked about it. <laughs> it was good times. Good times. All right, so I got my two eggs. We're just going to give them a little whiskey whisk. You could totally season these two if that's your jam. I did put quite a bit of seasoning in that flour, but it sure doesn't look like it. But we're just going to roll with it. I'm eating them. I'm eating them, so. Because... If you've been here before, you know Zane's not going to eat these, even though I almost... Okay, that's a lie. I totally didn't have him convinced at all. He said that. He said I was going to run him over. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. All right, so I got my tongs here. I have my tomatoes. I already cut them. I keep them kind of thick because I kind of like it like that. It's kind of thick, just a little bit. Um... Go the thickness that you want to, you guys, but if you're doing them, don't make them too thin because then you're going to end up with chips. I mean, that wouldn't be a bad thing either, though. Like, let's be honest, right? That wouldn't be a bad thing either. We're going to do the, the little double dipper here. So I'm just going to grab a little slice. I'm going to dump it in my flour. I know you can't see my flour. We're going to give it one little layer of flour. We're going to go in with the egg. This is getting real hot. Okay, now we got it all slimy with the egg, and we're going to go back to the flour. And I probably should have put gloves on this for this because there's nothing worse than having little goopy hands from flour and egg, but whatever, it is what it is. It is what it is, and I'm not even going to worry about it tonight. Not even going to worry about it. All right, we're going to rock it out in this hot-ass oil and keep dipping. We're going to just keep dipping. So y'all know I'm going to have to step away to wash my hand off, at least get most of this flour off of here when we're done. What can I say? He's from North Dakota. <laughs> I love it. It's okay. It was a good time anyways. Are you guys all packed up? Sue's moving y'all. Sue's moving. Makes me sad and happy. Makes me sad for me and happy for her.
Gotta keep an eye. I gotta keep one eye over here. You know, gotta keep one eye going. Because y'all know how I like to burn things when I'm entertaining you. <laughs> Sometimes I wish I could just stick my fingers in the hot oil just to get it all crispy, but no thank you. No thank you. Not down for that. We're getting there, you guys. I promise. I promise. So I gotta know, do you have a favorite kitchen gadget? I'm not typically like a gadget person, but I do. I own a few, and I'm talking like gadgety gadgets, not like tongs, because everybody should own tongs in my book. I'm talking like crazy. You have like a, a pineapple core thing. I know Miss Gail does. She loves that damn thing too. <laughs> we were talking about it yesterday. Oh, side note, guys. Gail, Miss Gail, who does not cook, uh, gave me a canner yesterday, a little, little canner guy, so I will be doing some more BBK BBQ. I know Serena was interested in that. I'm very excited about it, honestly. I'm scared, though, because I don't want to make nobody sick, and I'm not. That was, yesterday was, like, literally the second time in my life I've canned anything, so I just don't want to make anybody ill. It's my biggest thing. All right, we're gonna stop for a minute here. Get most of this off my hand anyways. Get most of it going. Because these are looking nice and toasty. Ooh, Brenda would be yelling at me right now. She'd be like, don't open your mouth over the hot oil. <laughs> Ooh, nice and golden. Call these bad boys pony boys. Stay golden, pony boy. Beautiful. Look at that. Look how beautiful they are. Can you guys see that? I don't know. Woo! All right. I'm just going to let it ride for a minute. I'm going to let it ride. Movers came today. A few things to do tonight. That's exciting. Again, I'm so excited for you and sad for me because I'm selfish like that. How is everybody else doing? I know I've been chatting with Sue, but she's the only one saying anything. I see there's other people on here. Y'all can say hello too, it's okay. Don't be scared. All right, I'm gonna get a plate. Because I got lost in uh, Instagram land, so I was not prepared. Big fat shocker, right? Work out with a little bit of paper towel here. Or newspaper, if you got newspaper, you know, ad day. Save that for stuff like this, because why not, right? Why not? Why not? And I was freezing earlier, you guys, so I had put my sweatshirt on, and now I'm like, oh, I should have taken this off before I started the show. Tugging away. Tugging away at it. It was cold today, though. Well, to me, it was cold. I mean... If I'm being honest, I'm I'm always cold. All the time. Move my little egg over here. All right. Check these bad boys out. We're going to know that they're done because we're going to give them a little fork test. At least that's what my mom used to do. Give them a little fork test. Oh, they're still pretty rock hard in the middle, so we're going to let them ride for a few minutes. But I'm not going to make you guys wait, because that's boring, and I can't do, like, interpretive, never mind, we won't even go there, interpretive dance. All right, so, that is what I have. So, easy peasy lemon squeezy, slice up your green tomatoes, and I know, I know that there's some sort of sauce. I am not sure what it tastes like, but I can just about bet that up in my cupboard, I probably have a jar of it, and I've never opened it because it kind of terrifies me. Apparently, you can make a sauce out of green tomatoes called chow chow. Chow chow? Something like that. So, if you've had that before, please let me know what that tastes like. Because, again, I'm terrified. I had a customer when I worked at FedEx that gave me a jar of it. And I was so scared 
I was just scared. I was scared to open it. So it's still sitting up there, homemade jar of it. I don't even know how long it lasts in the jars like that. Cause hi, brand new to canning here. Brand new, have you met me? Yeah, all right. Um, yeah, but apparently you make that with green tomatoes. So if that's your thing, if you have a bunch of tomatoes and you are too impatient to wait for them to all ripen or you have ever tasted chow chow or whatever it's called, let me know what it tastes like because I'm, I'm kind of intrigued now. Now that I'm a little bit older, a little bit older, I'm kind of intrigued with what this tastes like. And I might just dig up there to see if I still have it, just to try it and find out from my damn self. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? All right, that is what I have. I did not upload YouTube videos this week. Um, I will do that. I, I do promise you that. I just cannot promise you when. Possibly tomorrow, but then we got Wednesday, so then it goes back to Thursday. You know, this is, this is my conundrum. I almost feel like I should just tell you guys, like, once a month, I'm just going to dump a bunch of YouTube videos on you. So then I can, I can get the messages in my own, uh, in my notifications that tells me that there's a YouTube video I might like. And it's mine. Of course, that's always fun. Of course I'm going to like it. Why wouldn't I like it? When I'm uploading them, I'm cracking myself up. So, I don't know, man. Sometimes they just do that to me. It's hilarious. Anyways, I will see you all on Wednesday. I don't know what we're going to make. Right now, I'm just going to make a mess and burn the cap out of my delicious green tomatoes. Actually, they're looking lovely. Looking lovely. Getting there, getting there. And I will take a picture of them when they're all done. And I'll even cut one open so you can see what it looks like in the middle. But, but guess what? It's probably just green in the middle. Because it's Never mind. All right. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for showing up. Kitchenettes, Kitchen Littles, and Kitchen Nuggets. Until Wednesday at 6 p.m. Cheers. Keep sharing the love. Keep showing up. Y'all keep showing up. So do I. Have a lovely evening.